What's up, you guys? Welcome back to the channel. We got the new structure deck, Legend of the Crystal Beast. Uh, so uh, I know all the players have been waiting for this deck because there's Crystal Beast in it and there's Ash Blossom. So let's get into it. All right, so you guys, so I'm already loving the box art. Um, I believe this is a limited edition uh, structure deck, um, kind of like the shadow one. Uh, so very, very cool. Very, very cool. I love the box art. I love the coloring on it. We all love those uh, Crystal Beast colors. Jesse Anderson um, is the uh, the owner of Crystal Beast, correct? Yeah. One of the most decorated duelists in Yu-Gi-Oh! GX. So let's get this bad boy open, open up. So simple, just the deck, the deck cover, and then the play mat. Let's check out this play mat here. So for those that are new to the game, this is a great way to get involved. It's kind of like a little magazine here. It's gonna show you all the information you need. Hot cards, uh, many more powerful cards in this deck, and it shows you some. Some, I mean, Ash Blossom, we all know. When an effect that involves pulling cards out of the deck is activated, discard this card from your hand to negate their, that effect. This can buy you time to assemble your strategy while negating an effect crucial to your opponent's plans. So, just uh, shows you recent sets, very, very hot recent sets. Oh, and uh, available this fall. I know, I know George is hyped for this. So. Yes, I am. So, cool little play mat there. And then we got the, we turned it down, we got the all-powerful rainbow ultimate form of the rainbow dragon so we're going to look into that when we open this up so let's place this mat right here this would be our placeholder and then we have the deck right here so another ultra form of rainbow dragon beautiful beautiful wow that's 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 just so nice so let's pop this bad boy open okay Bam. So we got the rainbow dragon in its ultra rare form. The stars are hollow. The M the attribute is hollow. Looking clean. We have the ultimate crystal rainbow dragon overdrive looking clean. That's the cover card of the deck. Very powerful card. Um, remember, this does have a, a, a meta form. This deck can be converted into meta. Uh, maybe I can get a video for you guys. Oh, the Crystal Beast Rainbow Dragon, which comes out of Ghost from the Past 2, did get a reprint here as well. So it's good to uh, easy access. Rainbow Bridge of the Heart. Crystal Bond. Their Searcher. So that's always good to have in a ultra rare rarity. This came out of LDS 1 and uh, I believe LED uh, 4 or 3, I believe. So Rainbow Over Dragon. And then the. Two tokens. I thought it was three tokens. I think it's in the back as well. Oh, there's a okay. Beautiful and they're hollow. I'm gonna be rocking this one. This one's fire. This one's lit. This one's got this one's fire. That's fire. Wow, look at the shine on that. So I really like this camera angle we got going on. It's nice. And then with the OGs, the OGs. This is hot right now. This is hot in uh, tier element. You play it with the new trap card from uh from the Megatons. Crystal Keeper, and then we have Hamon. This is always in the Crystal Beast strategies. Dimension Sifter, so this is a cheaper version than the one from the Megaton. Um, this would probably be around a dollar uh, as a common, so uh, good to have this one. Contact C, uh, that's always in and out of the format. And here we go, what every player that is on a budget is looking for. Ask Blossom, enjoy a spring. So, more of a reason to go out and get the structure deck and in triple kits. Uh, you need, you know, you use rule of three, so you want to get three decks. And then that means you have three Ash Blossoms and three Dimension Shifters and three Ghost Spells. So Ghost Spells are common now. Beautiful card. Everyone's favorite Ghost Girls. So the Awakening the Crystal Beast Ultimates, I believe this is a new card as well. Crystal Aegis, another new card. And Rainbow Bridge, another Rhoda for Spell and Traps. Crystal Abundance, Crystal Promise, Crystal Tree, Rare Value. We all know Rare Value is a great card for Crystal Beast, that immediate draw power. Advanced Dark, and then Melody of the Awakening Dragon. 
Foolish Burial Goods, Cosmic Cyclone. Crystal Pair, Crystal Conclave, Ultimate Crystal Magic card out of LDS 3 as well. Uh, LDS uh, 1, I believe. My bad. LDS. Crystal Beast got a big reprint in the LDS 1. Um, Fair Flames, a card that people were wanting a reprint of. Did get an errata, I believe. Or like a, a, a ruling change? So there you guys go read it. Uh, yeah. Card has been some hype. Has some hype behind it. Metaverse. Metaverse. Crystal Beast token. So that is cool. That's cool. I like that one. All right, you guys. So, um, want to remember? Like I said, rule of three. You want to go and pick up three of these decks. Uh, these are the foils right here. I love them. They're beautiful cards. These are just beautiful right here. Super beautiful. I love the crystal bond. Um, the rainbow bridge of the heart, which is uh, during your main phase, you can normal summon one crystal beast monster in addition to your normal summon. You can only use each of the following effects of Rainbow Bridge per turn. During your main phase, you can destroy one Crystal Beast card you control or in your hand. If you do, add one Crystal Spell Trap from your deck to your hand. If a Crystal Beast is placed in your Spell and Trap Zone, even during a damage step, you can turn one card your opponent controls, return both that card and this card to the and this card to the hand. So, a uh, very cool card for the strategy. Um, uh, that is new and that is interesting uh, to use. Um, we have, of course, we have seen uh, the Ultimate Crystal Rainbow Dragon. That was one of the first cards. Uh, wow, this so this goes to put it right there for you guys. I'm gonna read it there. This card gains 7,000 attack. If this card has not battled this turn, you can tribute this card, shuffle as many cards on the field as possible into the deck. And if you do so, summon any number of months of banished crystal beast uh, monsters. So, powerhouse card right here. And I just love the artwork. Need to the bathroom? Oh, he has to go to USPS. Mm -hmm. Can I continue where you left off? Yeah. Let's go. Cool. There's just a lot of good cards in here. Yeah, they keep reprinting Cosmic. It's because I guess the player base really likes the card and make it accessible. Alrighty, so we got most of the staples laid out for you guys. Uh, key reprints here um, for the players, collectors. Um, so great, great reason to, great incentive to go out and buy this deck. And of course, a nice little master duel marketing right here. So that's a beautiful uh, blue uh, uh, Chaos Max blue eye. So, uh, that, that is beautiful right there. Uh, go out, get this deck for two reasons. If you are a Crystal Beast fan, of course, you're going to go run out and get this. I know the staples don't even matter if you're a Crystal Beast fan. And then, uh, of course, you want to get these staples. These staples, this is out of a structure deck. This is the most bang for your buck that I've seen in maybe uh, the uh, Salaman Great one. So, um, wow. Just, I've never seen a structure deck with Ghost Spell, Asphalt, and D-Shifter, Foolish, Burial Goods. Um, it just, look at the list. Look at the list. Uh, no, can't can't say anything else about this. And and these tokens are just so dope, so fresh. Look at that, right there. So good job, Konami. Konami's been ending the year very powerful, very strong. We'll see how I, I'm very interested to see how Darkwing Blast plays out. The new Battles of Legend. Um, which one? What the 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 oh, but the Dark World. Yeah, the Dark. We'll be doing the Dark World structure deck here. Uh, we'll have that for you guys as well. That's a big one too. Um, more meta competitive, uh, more meta uh, possibilities in this deck, but this deck is great for fun, uh, casual gameplay, of course. And if you want to be creative and you, you could make this compete, hopefully we can have a video that uh, goes into those themes as well. So um, I want to thank you guys for watching the video. Please remember to like the like the video, subscribe, and we appreciate you guys. Thank you.